For sale, 2023 Thor Rise 18M, 10,500 miles. That's the information you need to check it out. Now I'll show you the rest. I'm in my tiny home here in Alamogordo, New Mexico. And outside we'll walk and there will be a Class B RV for sale. That's mine. And we'll go over it. I'm just going to give you an overview. It's $75,000. Firm. Don't even offer anything less. That's the best deal on the internet for sure. On the roof, you'll see in the very front there, a little black dot right there. That's the Sirius satellite antenna. To the, just behind that, the first thing you see is the vent fan. And the next is the wine guard Wi-Fi uh, booster and then behind that is the air conditioner roof ac and then behind that is 200 watts of solar on the roof okay you see that and then that's the ram chassis and we'll go down now and i'll show you just give you the highlights if you want to if you want to buy the unit or, or get serious you can contact me at rusty r-u-s-t-y seven eight six zero nine at gmail.com now we'll get, get, do a quick overview and we're done. It's like new, man. I mean, hell, it's got 10,500 miles on it. I mean, we'll start with the front area here. You got some little pockets in the doors there. Of course, you got those mirrors fold and uh, you got the window cover that comes with it and it's a good one. Uh, you got a little storage above the seats here. <coughs> it's got the light colored seats, which I like. Both these seats swivel. It's got a couple of cup holders there got a big screen there your backup camera and stuff and that's basically it okay uh, that, that mat came with it now we'll shut this door and I'll show you some stuff here that's the solar connector this right here is that's for this is for cable TV that big box the square there and then this is your uh, electric connection uh, when you got shore power that's your uh, propane tank fill and that little red button there whenever you're using the rv you turn that on and that way you've got propane to your uh, stove or whatever and then right up here that's for the uh what do they call this thing it's called a truma that's it's got a truma heater system on it and of course this is a sewer hose here and that little cap on the end comes off and you get the hose out and this is the fresh water fill here and then this is the uh, water for the, you know, if you, if you got water hookup available. And there's also an outside light that comes in handy. And this door, these doors, as you can see, they'll fold all the way out. You see what I mean? And uh, there is a outside shower and it's got some stuff here and there. And then those window covers come with it, of course. And then over here, uh, this is the outside shower hose. It plugs in here. And then, uh, or is that for propane? No, that's right, that, that's the shower. And then that's the water pump, light, and then that's a 12 volt deal. That's a double 110 in case you're doing something outside and you need power. This, it's got a rear bath, okay? It's a wet bath. That's the shower curtain. You just pull it all the way around like that. There's the shower head. It's got a cassette black water tank, five gallon. And you just push this button here and this thing, this comes out and you go dump it and put it back, okay? And, you, and you, you, I've never used the black, okay? I, I just use, I haven't even used the gray, okay? I pee in the jug, poop in the bag, throw the bag away, enough said about that. As far as storage back here, this is your wardrobe right here. Uh, it's not the biggest thing in the world, but for one person or two, it's probably okay. That's all your uh, owner's manuals there. And then this is uh, storage, more storage, and then there's a sliding door here, right here really. And, and you can close this area off if you choose to. And then this is the bed. And then there's some more stuff there. We'll get on the inside and see that. This is just a mat I put here. And this is a little handheld rechargeable vacuum. That's the recharge thing there. And then we're going around here. And this door also folds all the way out. And what else? Uh, over here, you've got your sliding door and uh, yeah, this screen comes with it. Yeah, it's a Velcro thing all the way around, and but it comes with the RV, or it came with the RV. And then we go in, it's got some pretty light colored linoleum, 
I added that mattress because the mattress that came with it sucks. This is a 3.2 cubic foot refrigerator. I'll show it to you now. We're in the right deal here. It's got a freezing compartment, fairly large, and then there, and then some stuff beneath, and then it's got some, uh, get around here where you can see it, uh, places to put stuff. And and then this, uh, let me get the phone back around here. Where am I? There's <laughs> not much telling what I've done now. Uh, yeah, that's right. Uh, okay, this thing slides out here. You know, give you more countertop. Hi. Anyway, uh, this is the two burner cooktop right here. Uh, this this came out of the microwave. I, I keep it out when I'm traveling because it rattles. And this is the things I use for level. You just drop it down there. And when the bubble's close to the middle, you're good. And I added those two little mirrors there. They come in handy. And then this is more storage. It's got a 110 outlet there. And uh, two USB ports there. Uh, more USB ports over here. Cable and stuff. And uh, this is your deal, your sink. It's got that. It's got a little window there. This thing here, if you if you let it, you know, drop down in in here, it, it'll rattle when you're driving down the highway. Uh, this is microwave. Got some storage over here, right here, and uh, that little pot there. That's a good little slow cooker. Then you got three deals there for storage. Uh, more storage over here, just minor stuff. Double one ten, USB double. And then up here, you've got a double 110 again, more USB ports. So you've got plenty of USB ports and uh, plenty of storage for cans and stuff. And these, these are good cabinets. Uh, also, you have uh, you have uh, this table that swivels. You can move it anywhere you want to, out of the way or whatever. And then this thing here, this is a two-cup holder that came with it. It was, you know, because th there's a whole lot of cushions that I don't have in here. And the reason is they take up too much space, but you're welcome to take them with you when you buy the unit. So that's the sliding table. These swivel around, that swivels around. And uh, you got a little overhead storage here. You also have window covers up here, magnetic for that window and that window. And also there's another one up there for this side window. You know, when this door is shut, there's a big window right here and there's a magnetic cover for that window. So with that in mind, ladies and gentlemen, Oh, and this is the Truma, or excuse me, this is the BM Pro. You just tap it, and it shows you all the stuff. And uh, you, know, you tap that, and it'll show you your battery levels and stuff. I haven't been driving it, so, but yeah, you go to home there. And then that's that's the BM Pro uh, controls everything. You know, if you want to turn the air conditioner, you turn it on from right there. And that, it shows you all your battery levels. And it says fresh water tank, 18 gallons, gray tank, 20, propane, 5.7 gallons, or 24 pounds. And then this is your Truma unit. And whoever buys it, I'll show you how to do that. It's real simple. It took me a while to figure it out. But, you know, it's, it's nothing. It's real simple. But anyway, guys, from uh, Alamogordo, New Mexico, on a Friday morning, uh, the 29th, I believe, of March 2024, uh, if you're interested in this Thor rise 18m 2023 with 10,500 miles on it uh, let me know uh, again rusty78609 at gmail.com so with that in mind thumbs up guys use the amazon link if you choose to drink plenty of water and buy this rv thank you much bye bye